I'll let him. I'm out. Thanks for leaving your telegram, Obi. Oh, it's KF775. I remember it. coming up here. Yes. Holly? Shh, keep your voice down. I just sent you a telegram. Oh, yeah. I, I, I've been over here. Uh, there's gonna be a fight night or something. I was gonna fight in it. Where's that going on? I'm just over the hill. Oh, I can't be around large groups of people. There could be a deputy that recognizes me. Yeah, yeah. Probably him. For the best. Sorry? Uh, nothing, I just... Hey, how, how you been? <laughs> On the run? Sure. I mean... I mean alone? <laughs> all the time? Yeah. Um... Well, uh... I, I gotta, um, wait to hear from the others, but... After that, I mean, if you're ever around and, uh, you know, need somebody to ride with you or just be around, I, I'm, I'm available. I hope. I saw Julius a few days ago. He was talking about doing a bank. He apparently oh. had done one solo before, but I think with all the new deputy they've got, deputies they've got around, it's probably not going to be possible the way it was. So. Sure. Yeah. Um, we was trying to do one, but Sheriff Cash wouldn't leave Valent- or not Valentine, Blackwater. So we didn't end up doing it. But I think maybe if we had a few more people, it would work out. So I'm sure that he'll want to do something like that. But maybe when he's around, I don't know if he'll be around tomorrow or what. Yeah. Yeah, maybe if he find people or something, I'm sure Michael would be interested, Isabella. Anyways, well, uh, <laughs> I really I don't have anything to do but hole up and hide, so. Right. Yeah. Might as well enjoy your fight night while he's not in the run. Yeah. I guess. Um, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll enjoy another fight night, I guess. You really didn't recognize me when you came up here, though? Uh, those, uh, goggles are, are really something. Yeah, I know, aren't they? Yeah. That, like, um, makes me know it's a good choice. The the hair was, you know, what kind of tipped me off once I heard your voice at least, but the, the goggles definitely threw me. Good, good. <laughs> hey, uh... Like I said, I, I know you probably don't know somewhere and, and whatnot, and that's fine. I just, um, uh, if you don't, um, hear from me on a Monday, uh, just wanted to say that you're, uh, you're, you're, you're a real good friend, Holly. Wait, what's, and, uh, what, no, what's happening Monday? Uh, and th nothing's happening Monday, um, but before that, uh, I'm supposed to meet with, uh, the Jules and, um, Isabella talked to me just a few hours ago and <clears throat> she's, uh, she's not very happy, but, uh, I believe that the words she said were, um, uh, I, I, I don't plan to kill you, Opie. Wait, what? 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 I, what? 
What's happened? What's happened? I thought you was one of the jewels. What? What's going on? Maybe this uh, is the best place to speak. Uh, can we move away from the station? Can you speak right now? I, I just want to know what's going on. I thought I come to regard you sort of as a friend, Obi. You don't really sound yourself right now. Yeah. I, I, don't, I don't know. Just um, I, I'm I'm supposed to meet with the jewels, and they're uh, they're right to decide what they will for me. What do you mean? What's happened? Did did, did you not get my my telegram? Well, yeah, I got a telegram, but I didn't. You did something that makes them upset with you. I, maybe I missed that part. I have to reread it. I, um, I didn't get that from it. Holly, I, I'm, I, I read it, Holly. Wait, you read it? Why? How? Uh, <clears throat> I, I, I'm, uh, I, I told the, uh, I, I told the, the Chinzos everything that happened in that in the cave uh I, I wasn't in the best headspace um and they kind of came across me at the right time and i, I just kind of uh let it out and i knew i messed up right after but it, it already happened and then the the chinzos uh told others and they told others, and it spread until everybody in the crossing knew about what happened in that cave and the position of Van Horn and where uh, we were going. Um, you know, I, I got uh, I got out today, and Gunn told me that he'd come across. Uh, multiple people that uh, were civilians or even criminals or law or nothing that had brought up about how I am a uh, <clears throat> a, a, dirt, a dirty rat and I asked him if he had heard uh, from any of the other folk in my side of profession and he said no and I said uh that's that sounds bad he said yes it sounds very bad ob which is why i would like to get you down to mexico because i believe they're coming for um i i, I don't know what's what's gonna happen but the uh jewels i put into a very tough position and uh they they deserve to make a choice so I, I told him I'd you think they're just gonna them. you think they're just gonna kill you did, did, did Julius know this reason because I spoke to him not that long ago and he was looking forward to you getting out and he didn't he didn't seem no. to be talking about anything of, like this I, I, I don't believe he does listen you, you okay. should go yeah yeah Goodbye, Holly. Uh. Goodbye, Opie. Alright, so, King, I spoke with Opie and found him to be sitting at rock bottom, even further than, than when he spoke to me before about the hard time he's been having. Considering what he's done, I understand that it puts everyone in a tight spot and is anything but good. Since I have come to consider Obi to be a good friend, I want to remind and implore you to consider how absolutely strung up this entire wa war has been. Obi has been has had one hard knock after another and has absolutely not been in a good place. I know that I'm nobody in this situation, but I'm asking for mercy when it comes to his fate. You mentioned to me that you were dissatisfied with the Jewel's re relationship with Van Horn. Perhaps this is simply an opportunity to put distance between your group and theirs as you wished. I personally believe that Obi has everyone's best interest in mind, but that he made a mistake, as we are all wont to do from time to time. 
I'm asking that this not be his list. Apologies if I've overstepped in any way, but I want to make sure these points were heard. Regards, Holly. OB Julius. Obi, I appreciate you reaching out. Truthfully, I have no ill will towards OB. Just as I told Kenamon, the concept of rats means nothing to me. Well, I don't think it is wise to go to Chenzo's for his own safety as much as ours. I'm not upset with him. I haven't heard from him while he's been locked up, but maybe that's on me for not reaching out. We'll talk tomorrow if you'll be around. Oh, that's good. That's a relief. That's a big relief. Are you 989? Thank you for your response. You may wish to reach out to him. He acts like one who won't see many more days, and that tends to mean a person's likely to be more reckless. Holly. Cool, cool, cool. Well, that's good. That's a, that's, that's a feels good for Holly there. I literally burst into tears. Poor OB. I like Julius, guys. He's cool. 